This is Jessica Hawkins, and last week she became the first woman in five years to test a modern Formula One car. Jessica is Aston Martin's driver ambassador and a W Series podium finisher and British karting champion. And last week she took part in a test with Aston Martin at the Hungaro Ring, where she drove their 2021 car, the AMR21, and in doing so became the first woman to test a modern Formula One car since 2018. She completed 26 laps and according to the team got up to speed quickly and was matching the reference lap times. Jessica said that this was a dream come true for her and something that's taken her every bit of blood sweat and tears to get to. Aston Martin's team principal Mike Crack said that it was a special moment for both the team and for Jessica as she prepares to support the team's F1 Academy entry next year. Not only was this a significant moment for Jessica, but also for women in motorsport generally, as unbelievably it's been five years since a woman last tested an F1 car. Tatiana Calderon got behind the wheel of Sauber's C37 car in 2018 in Mexico City. Her run was part of a promotional event for Alfa Romeo Sauber and part of her role as the team's test driver at the time. In Formula 1's 73 year history, only five women have made race starts, and prior to Calderon's 2018 run, the last woman to have driven an F1 car was Susie Wolfe in 2015 in free practice at the British Grand Prix. Unfortunately, Susie's opportunity to become the first woman to start an F1 race since 1976 was scuppered, and she announced her retirement from racing as she felt the current environment in F1 the way it is meant a full-time race seat wasn't going to happen. Unfortunately, not much has changed since then. We're still yet to see a woman join Formula 1 full-time or even start a race in the modern era, and the opportunities for women currently appear to be limited to test runs. But but these runs represent a step in the right direction, as does the work of women like Susie Wolfe in creating the F1 Academy, which will be supported by the 10 Formula 1 teams and televised from 2024. There's still a long way to go, but with women like Jessica Hawkins at the forefront, it can't be long until we see a woman return to Formula 1. When do you think it will happen? Let us know in the comments, like this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe to Apex for the latest in the F1 world.